specific habitats may not be continuous in the environment. So for example, coral reefs may be separated by open sea floor without corals. Forested regions can be separated by mountains or rivers or oceans. And so therefore populations may be restricted to certain geographic areas. If members of a population expand into a new region, very often a limited number of individuals do this, sometimes only one. So the representatives which reach the island are a small subset of the original population, or the ones which cross the river, or the mountain range, or get to the forested region on the other side of the desert. This may be a small subset of the original population. The characteristics of the new population will therefore be determined by the features which were present in the founders of that population. This is known as the founder effect. So a change in an overall allele frequency can occur if a small population founds a new larger population whose alleles will now be determined by the subset of alleles which were present in the founders. Consider the following examples where members of a large, varied population cross a barrier to found a new population. In what ways will the phenotypes in the new population differ from that of the ancestral population? 